at 453 feet long and displacing 4,100 tons of water, USS Thatch is the smallest vessel in our strike group and our only frigate. This mighty warship packs a powerful punch, carrying equipment and weapons vital to protecting strike group assets through anti-submarine warfare. When we were crossing the Pacific, uh, we wanted to make sure that no submarine snuck up on you. Um, that was really a predominant role uh, when we were together. Uh, that's traditional blue water ops. Wherever we move to, we disaggregate to accomplish the fleet commander's mission in his theater of responsibility, but we have the capability to re-aggregate together and operate as a strike group at any time, which is a pretty powerful fighting tool. Anti-submarine warfare is only one of many missions that supports. Since arriving on station in the Arabian Gulf mid-July of this year, Thatch was assigned to Commander Task Group Iraqi Maritime, acting as a picket ship protecting the Al Basra Oil Terminal, or ABOT. The, the frigate certainly enhances what we can do in, in, in several areas, it provides us with flexibility, it provides us with a visible deterrent out here as well. The ABOT provides a significant percentage of Iraq's gross domestic product. It, 70 to 85 percent of Iraq's GDP goes to market via these oil terminals. These oil terminals provide the financial resources that Iraq needs in order to regain its stability. Thatch and coalition forces also trained Iraqi forces in the area on maritime security operations. The big mission here is to defend and to deter against attack, but also to transition control of the defense of the Al Basra oil terminal back to Iraqi control. And we're doing that by training their Navy, uh, training their Marine Corps, and training them on both point defense of the Al Basra oil terminal and picket defense, which is what we're doing. Thatch's visit board search and seizure, or VBSS teams, also played a vital role in the security of the area and defense of the ABOT. Uh, we do security sweeps of many of the Iraqi vessels heading towards Al Basra oil terminal. Uh, we make sure that they don't have any contraband on board, no explosives. Make sure you guys get the top. For the most part, they're very grateful that we're out here because they see what we're doing and they know even when we're boarding them that our intentions are good and that it's, it's for their best interest and we're mainly looking out for them. So they appreciate us for the most part and are usually pretty compliant. So when we don't see Thatch or any of the other ships in our strike group floating off in the distance, rest assured they won't be gone for long. But while they are gone, they're carrying out a different mission in direct support of Operation Iraqi Freedom. For Hellcat News, I'm Petty Officer Benjamin Lewis.